Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Drew's Adventures. Today I am in the Broken Hill Mint and Art Gallery here in Broken Hill in Western New South Wales. Here's your little section here where you can walk and it's wheelchair friendly, mobility friendly, so it's really really good to see. It's called the Big Canvas Print. So you wouldn't think this, but Australia is always known for its big things, big statues and big icons. We've got the big galah, the big koala, the big mango, the big apple. All sorts of things and this is the big canvas print and it really does make you feel like you're watching a outback landscape almost alive
go with an old dryer sign here and we've even got the bathroom heater still intact this would have been the bathroom here let's have a wander let's look at the beautiful high ceilings that would keep you nice and cool in summer that's for sure there's not a lot left of the guts of this place so this is the lounge room here and have a look at that ceiling rose that colonial ceiling rose this might be master bedroom i think through here no ceiling rose but they do have that wonderful roof wander back through i don't think there's a whole lot else here to explore but have got this beautiful um fireplace with a mirror mantelpiece as well and the gold etching around it we're having a look here at this very much abandoned and for sale house in rural New South Wales there's not a lot left of it, I must say, but it is in prime position given that you've got the service station just over the road. This has obviously lost a wall here, I think, at some point. I would say this would be 1950s, Heather? Probably, yeah. A lot of broken windows, it's very boarded up. have to be careful where we step because it looks like some of these floors are a bit average. <laughs> We've got the old AMS Simpson cooker. Okay, we've got the toilet there with a naughty magazine on the floor. <laughs> a lot of termite damage. You can see the termites have eaten through this wood quite thoroughly. One of the bedrooms here. bits of clothing and rags on the ground, broken up glass everywhere, There'd be a lot of clean up to fix this one up I think, I think if you were going to you would just knock it down. The bathroom here I guess, might have been another room there too, really old wardrobe or cupboard just here, oh, got a little magazine there about cats, it's a cat thing there, wander over here, oh no that's the bathroom I think there, yeah that was it, it's a micro tiny bathroom, just a shower really that you'd step right into, incredible, here's Werner, a lot of bottle caps, oh, I must have collected bottle caps, <laughs> eclectic little place, very much a miner's cottage, Workers Cottage. Yeah, there's your old bathtub. How cool is that? Definitely drug use has occurred in here. We've got syringe wrappers and caps. And that's why when you're venturing into abandoned houses, you need to be so careful of these things because they are particularly nasty. You don't want to get a needle stick injury. Hello everyone, it's Drew from Drew's Adventures. Here in Broken Hill for the last instalment of this Broken Hill trip. And I'm at the Pro Heart Gallery. Now, for those in Australia, you would remember Pro Heart's ads where it was for a, um, a carpet company, I think. And they used to, he used to, um, throw all of the fruit and paint all over the the ground and um, then the uh, then the, the lady, an older lady would come along and say, oh no Mr. Pro, Mr. Hart, I have to clean all that up. And so yeah, we're having a look today Heather Werner and I at his private collection of vehicles and his art gallery. These are Rolls Royces, actually no they're Bentleys, one's a Rolls, this is a Bentley right here. And as you can see, it's got Pro Heart on it. That's worth a fortune, wouldn't it? Bentley like that, yeah. And then over here we have the Rolls Royce. What a beautiful vehicle. He was very much into his cars as well. 
and he is or was a Broken Hill legend really um, quite well known and he's unfortunately passed away but yeah his uh, legacy lives on through his art that's still very collectible in Australia and we've got um, this Rolls Royce here look at that isn't that beautiful with the, the phantom part on there and this one here with all of his paint on it that's amazing the outback scenes all the different outback scenery here here we go so here is the Pro Harp studio where all the magic happened and he had a really eclectic style there's the man himself, the picture of him back there. <coughs> very, very back. There he is. It's beautiful. Yeah. Hmm. That's awesome. Outback scenes, flowers, plants, all sorts of things. Here's probably the silver here. Oh, look at that. That's a cute little thing, isn't it? Little silver setting. Very clever. Mm. Oh, that's cool, isn't it? That's a spot gun for paint. <laughs> mm. Yeah, there you go. John Mason's nail sculpture. Oh, these are all nails. Wow. <laughs> They're all made of nails. That whole sculpture's made of nails. Yeah. Isn't that clever? Yeah. That's really cool. So I'm going to pop on the stained plastic cover there. Oh, cool. Yes, please. Oh, yeah. Cool. Yep. 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 the second one. Master 2 Carpet will repel. It may repel Pro Hard, but it won't make 
So, there are, are about three levels, I think, to the entire gallery. And of course, here's the famous bee that we saw before on the Stainmaster carpet ad. <laughs> That's actually on carpet, which is really clever. You can see the carpet fibers there. And I think that's Pro Harp out in the bush. We've got some abstract pieces here. There you go, Monday morning minor. Hmm. So here we go, just going to give you a bit more of a walk around. Love that. Some flowers. Yeah, look at that. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Hmm. Hmm. some more scenes that Prohard painted of activities, especially out in the bush in the outback. We've got shearing, rodeo, buskers, line dancing, uh, queens, you name it. Pretty awesome. Hmm. Reclining nude. Well, that concludes our little look around the Pro Heart Gallery here in Broken Hill. Really hope you have enjoyed seeing some of Pro Heart's uh, work. I'd highly encourage you to come up to the gallery in Broken Hill in far west New South Wales and check it out for yourself. Take care, everyone. Please like the video if you haven't already. If you're not subscribed, then be lovely to have you on board on my YouTube channel and YouTube community. Take care. Bye for now.